And you have to be in tune with how your brain thinks. And if you're ever going to be a leader, if you're ever going to be a boss, if you're ever going to be a coach, if you're ever going to be in charge of somebody, including being a dad, you need to know how the people under you process things, how they think. I can't tell you where in your life and how you talk and whether you use profanity and whether you wear one earring or two earrings or no earrings or nine tattoos or tattoos up your neck or tattoos only when you wear a short sleeve shirt nobody can see or if the tattoos are just one color or if they're all multicolored or what you say on Twitter, or how your language is on Twitter, or what your purpose is on Twitter, or what your body language is, or how you introduce yourself, or what your tone of voice is, or what kind of clothes you wear, or do you tuck your shirt in, do you tie your shoes, is it about you when you make a three, do you do this, do you do this, do you do this, what is it? I can't tell you what any of that is. But what I can tell you is the people that are writing about it, the people that are reading it, the people that are watching it, I can't tell you how their brain thinks. But they're coming up with something. And so you have to be really aware at all times. Because one word, one relationship, one handwritten note, one phone call, one non-return message, one delete the email, screw what that person thinks, you never know where the dots are connected and how it may help you or hurt you 10 years from now, 15 years from now, 20 years from now. And that's why always tell the truth, comma, no matter your emotional state, period. 